Okay, here we go. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Palimpsest Live. <laughs> um, Palimpsest is where we are sending physical paintings around the world and we are all uh, adding a little bit of paint. Oh, sorry. I think I have an echo thing happening here. I don't know what's happening. Uh, I don't hear it anymore. I'm sure it's fine. Anyhow, we are sending paintings around the world. We are all adding a layer and we are together as a group creating 13 really cool paintings. So today I am here with Lara from the UK. Wave to us, Lara. Hi. <laughs> Ross from LA. We have Rose all the way from Vancouver with the beautiful purple hair. And then Stephanie is joining us from Toronto. And we should also be joined a little later by Cheryl, who is uh, just getting up all the way over in Australia. It's, it's really early up there. So I think uh, we're, we're keeping our fingers crossed that her alarm clock is, uh, is going off and that she will be joining us soon. Um, there she is. <laughs> Speaking of the devil, there is Cheryl from this Australia. Hi, Cheryl. You are muted, Cheryl. We cannot hear you. <laughs> She's waving. Birds. I can hear your birds. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty. But we can't hear you. <laughs> She's Cheryl's doing sign language today. <laughs> no, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> There's an unmute button somewhere in the bottom, Cheryl. There we go. I know. I had this really strange ad running. <laughs> Yay! Oh, I've got it. We are all here. It's awesome. I'm so happy. So um, before we start our today's show, I wanted to do a quick round uh, to see where we're at because I was just saying to Stephanie before that I have no freaking clue where all those paintings are. I know Stephanie has one because she opened one last week. Um, and I think you want to talk about that a little bit later. Laura, did you have a painting? Yes, I have the same painting and I haven't done anything at all because I had my kids at home. It's, I, it's not my fault. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> but you have painting. Um, let me see. You have painting A, right? The painting that was started by Cheryl with the lily pond. Uh, yes. 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 Okay. The, 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 yeah, with the fish and the... Um, Do you have any ideas yet for that one? Uh, to be honest, uh, uh, I had so, two two weeks. Uh, I yeah no uh, no. <laughs> okay, that's fine. <laughs> no. Okay. No, because uh, 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 yeah, have, uh, it, it seems like I'm trying to find the excuses, but uh, it's true. My my head was so full, and I couldn't think because um, they were always asking. Mom, mom, mom. <laughs> so no, yeah, and yeah. Okay. It's fine. <laughs> no worries, no excuses needed. Okay, then according to my list, Cheryl should have the painting that Julie started. Is that correct, Cheryl? Yes. It's gone. Oh, okay. It's you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's it's on my and it's oh, way to please. me. Ooh, yeah. exciting. Yeah. So I'll have a one to, to open soon. I'm excited. I haven't seen it yeah. yet, but it might be in my mailbox. Who knows? Then I know, Stephanie, you have painting C. We'll talk about that a little later. And then I think painting D, I know that's with Ross, because you were going to hang that and never, ever get let go of it anymore. I have actually have two. And, and my whole studio was disrupted. Everything got pushed to the side and I had, I had, uh, um, I don't know what to call, well, it's in Jewish, it's called a Shiva. We, my, yeah. since my mother-in-law yeah. passed away, we had everybody over here for yeah. days and days and days and everything got pushed to the side. Now I have to find everything. I mean, like put everything carefully away and I have to remember where I put them. Yeah. yeah Cause according to my, getting old sucks. Doesn't... <laughs> yeah. According to my schedule, you should have three, actually. Myself. Ross, I think. I you should have Rose's painting, painting D. You should have Stephanie's painting with the hand. And uh, my painting is also that, that that ended with you. I don't have yours yet. 
You don't? Because that came from Julie. And that was a while back. Wow. Okay, I'll look and see, but I'm pretty sure I only have two. But um, did Julie finish it and send it off yet? I think so. I think she said she only needed to work on one more. And that's the, the that's the painting that's doing it with Stephanie right now. That's what she said at the time, and that's a couple of weeks ago. So uh well, we'll sit with her and make sure she hasn't lost one or Yeah, we'll we'll uh, yeah. we'll look into that. And then Rose, I think uh you should have painting E, is that correct? I have nothing. You have nothing. I haven't, I haven't received anything for months. Okay, that not would have been from Julie as well. Yeah. Yeah, not okay. since um, the one that was started by Julie that I sent on to Cheryl. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen anything. Okay, so we'll, we'll have to contact Julie to see where uh, painting E and G are, are uh, hanging out. Maybe uh, she forgot to post them or... Yeah. We'll have to figure that out. So that's important to, to make a note of that, that we do that. Because um, those are the, the ways of a project that moves around the world. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Stephanie, you said you opened the painting last week and you had some issues, I think. Uh, not issues, but um, a little bit of a conundrum. Let's see. Oh, this is just, I mean, it's already such a thing of beauty. Why bother adding anything more? <laughs> no, really, I think this is just so beautiful as it is. I, I'm, and you know, it's not because. So my hesitation isn't because I want to paint over anything that anyone else has done. It's because I honestly think this is so pretty as it is. I, I don't want to, um, I don't want to take away from its beauty by adding something just for the sake of adding it. However, I will, because that's our project. <laughs> so um, I was thinking maybe, I was thinking maybe some smoke up here. Um, and then I was also thinking, I was, or, because I, I want something to offset the fire, right? Because it's all about finding that harmony and that balance and, and how, you know, if we can't have light if we don't have darkness and the opposite. So I don't know, I was thinking maybe some drips of water. I'm still, I still have to really, you know, I, I really have to, um, I don't know, go over that in my mind, figure this out because it is a challenge. It really is a challenge. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm really, honestly, I think this is so funny. Just, the way it is. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, I'd just like to interject that I received that piece from Lara in its original untouched form. And I felt the same way. Yeah, I could see that. I could. I genuinely had to contemplate quite some time before I felt like my intervention was appropriate mm -hmm. because um, it, it looked complete. But now I see it mm. and I agree with you. It looks amazing. So I think we're all a little bit in our own way, maybe because of the way we're accustomed to looking and seeing in terms mm. of like our work or looking at something as we're consuming it on a gallery wall, for example, or on a screen, but this is a different kind of looking. Mm -hmm. And I think maybe we've got to all allow ourselves to just enter a whole new realm, honestly, because this piece is not finished. There's three more people to work on it, including you. Mm -hmm. So we've, we've got to, uh, yes, it's amazing, but it was amazing before anybody else had touched it. Like it truly was. <laughs> Sorry, two more people, including me now, right? Two more people. Uh, yeah, it's three total. Yeah, it's it's you and Cheryl, Cheryl and Julie. Yeah, so Julie also. Oh, is Julie is, Ju oh, right, of course. I, I, sorry, I forgot that Julie is actually finishing this. So, yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah. So three more people, yeah. So, so there's three more interventions. So I don't know. I'm just suggesting that maybe we all need to sort of step out of our own way and and face the fact that we're kind of breaking out of a box in the way we are accustomed to seeing and consuming art right that's good that's really well yeah. said Very yeah because it's it's not finished it's not allowed to be finished until the last right. person has touched it i yeah. know 
Yeah. And so it's maybe you should not own soul yeah. that it's developing as it grows. Yeah. Part of the oh. transformation. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I'll figure something out. <laughs> yeah. You have one more week according to our new scheduling. I know. And I'm going to stick to that. No, no, it's important though. Like I know we're laughing about it, but it is important because we have to get this thing moving, right? Yes. So yes, I will I will have it finished within the week, before the week, and we'll have it sent out to let me just double check here. To Cheryl. Uh, to Cheryl. Yes. When I'm done. So, yeah, but personally, Stephanie, I think you should do like an expressive arts therapy type thing. Go in your backyard, turn on some music, do some interpretive dance, turn around and paint on it. Okay. <laughs> and videotape <laughs> that whole session, please. <laughs> <laughs> My neighbors already think I'm crazy, so I have nothing to lose. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go out there in my swimsuit and put on the sprinkler or something. <laughs> it's so hot here. That's Look well. how red I am. This is a sunburn. Oh, it's so hot. Anyway. Oh, you're um, so lucky. You're so, so lucky. lucky. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's cold there. It's, it's cold lucky. here, too. Yeah. <laughs> that's, I don't understand that, but it, it because it's really hot here. Anyway, but um, yeah, I will figure that out. We will, we'll we will hear about that next week. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I, it's just so pretty. Yeah, it's really pretty. But, uh, are we going to show what uh, next week uh, what uh, we have done on the painting, or are we going to send? I think without showing here. I think we send without showing, so that the person who is mm -hmm. receiving it can open it on on okay. uh, on screen, basically on in the, in the live, and we can talk about it then. And then from that moment yeah. on, you'll have you two have weeks. The, you have the schedule in front of you, I think, mm -hmm. because I've seen uh, Can you tell me with, uh, to whom I, had, I need to send mine? Uh, you I have, uh, let me see, you have uh, sh the one with the um, lily pond, lily pond? Pet, the lily pond mm -hmm. painting A, that goes to Ross. Ross, OK. Yes. So Ross will be Ross. busy. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. No pressure. <laughs> no pressure at all. <laughs> okay. Uh, so did you check? Did you check mm -hmm. your visitors' bags when they left? They didn't take them, did they? <laughs> <laughs> well, I still suspect Ross just has painting a uh, D hanging on his wall somewhere where we cannot see it. <laughs> <laughs> Because he was very happy to see that one. <laughs> okay, so so um, to that order, the fact that we are uh, really need to start moving things along, because I uh, we all, I think we all felt that uh, things were stagnating a little bit. Um, yeah, yeah. Mostly also because apparently we've lost two paintings right now. <laughs> yeah, I think they all got whirled into a little windstorm of dust bunnies and julie's studio and yeah. she spits down like the tasmanian devil getting things done <laughs> something like that so we'll have to find yeah. those but i wanted to um really uh see if we can get started on our larger paintings and if we can get a sort of um a plan going for that and maybe even a little schedule on when we are going to start that Mm -hmm. I think we had decided yeah. that we were going to go for 18 by 24 panels because yeah. that's what Cheryl uh, was able to get. Yeah, that's what we decided. Okay, so are they going to be 18 across or 24 across? That's up to Why? you. But if we're going to be hanging them, they're going to be in different formats if we're doing... Yeah, but right now we also have a painting that can be viewed from any angle. So I think we want to keep that open. Okay. As long as they're the same size, I don't think it really matters. I feel that's an, I personally feel that that is an important, uh, like freedom that we need to allow ourselves. Mm -hmm. Also because they would be hanging on separately. Every painting is separate. So yeah. you can some paint, on um, landscape or some portrait 
And I think it's really interesting what is happening with a uh, painting. Let me say that correct. That was, which painting was that? That, that, that was Julie's painting. That's Julie's painting. The last, yeah, painting. B. The last one, painting B. Painting B, yes. That, that everybody sort of is viewing it from a different direction. I think mm. that's really interesting. So I think mm. that's, that's something that we. Just a question. So, so I agree that it gives us good freedom. But when we're actually in the gallery and we're looking at all the paintings and people are, are looking at all the paintings, will it feel more co cohesive? It doesn't matter. I'm just throwing this out here. Will it feel more cohesive if they're all actually landscape or all actually, you know, or all portrait? And the other thing to consider is because our intention is to also um, exhibit some of our own personal paintings, will it be the case where, for example, one painting is there and then um, there are you know, six uh, other paintings, like one each kind of thing, right next to that particular painting. I think maybe we need to give some thought to that as well. Or maybe well, I'm over, maybe I'm overthinking it. I don't know. Well, I'm just throwing it out there. I agree because in terms of submissions to curators, do we want to make it really easy for them and have everything in the same size and format, or do we want them to have to think about it when we're doing our own piece and how it's when is, everything is the same format as a curator, it's very easy to hang. Right. And it's very easy to plan it. Mm. When there are different formats, both portrait and landscape, and if we have different, it's, uh, want, again, to deal with, with our own pieces, so it's portrait, landscape, portrait, landscape, portrait, landscape, whatever, it makes it more complicated. And do we want to think about that? I mean, personally, proposals we don't know exactly who we're going to be showing with yet we had some great advice from hope already do we want to get some advice do we want to talk to somebody i mean i don't know i i feel strongly that uh especially because we are also entering our own works in this exhibition and all of us are working on different formats and different like landscape portrait like all already i feel that we have to look for when we do the exhibition our uh this project palimpsest will be in a separate area and they will just be together which makes it easier to hang them oh, okay so you're okay. thinking palimpsest on this wall individual artists on this wall essentially yeah yeah, I think I think that would be stronger as also a concept. Because it's, a, it's like, yeah, the concept uh, is all together. Mm -hmm. If you put uh, only the one painting and then our painting, maybe it, it lose uh, impact. The idea. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, <clears throat> I feel that it's thoughts on this. Well, I don't really have that much um, experience with gallerists and curators. But just in terms of the rhythm of a of a show, I think it might be good to ch change it up a little bit. You know, it's like I really like what Denise, what you're saying about this. The orientation of the piece um, is dependent on how how it's appearing to us as we as we do them. I think in that way it keeps it very organic, um, and it's one less rule out of a game that has really quite a few rules. So I think in that way it would be fun to to keep it loose. Okay, then second question. So our individual pieces, are we keeping them at 18 by 24 or are we just opening that up? We're opening that up to anything. All right, that's cool. Yeah, that way, uh, people who don't have time to make like a bunch of new work for an exhibition can just pick two, two paintings, one or two paintings. It depends on the size of the gallery too, right? Whether yeah. we can add like uh, one or two or three or four, like if it's a really large space, we can do a lot more. And if it's a smaller space, we can do a lot less. Okay, cool. All right, let's 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 work on that then. So yeah. we're gonna do 18 by 24 half inch cradle panel. Yes. Uh, one and a half inch. I thought it was small. Oh, yeah, gosh. it's one and a half. Right? Yeah, yeah, one and a half, half the, the thick one, yeah. the gallery. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Oh. Rose, does that mean you've already purchased your panel? Oh, I had them because we had said 20 by 24. So I have them and uh, I'll have to go and get something else. That's a little bit more hard to find. That's all. I, I can get you one. You're, you're in Montreal, right? Next week? Yeah, I'm leaving tomorrow morning. 
I can get you one and you can come pick it up. Well, that might be helpful because uh, Opus just has like their standards and then. Oh yeah, no, I can, I can get one really easily here. So let me just grab you one. One and a half. So, all right, for our own, are we going to be, we for our own pieces, it doesn't matter where we can put older pieces. We're yeah. not considering that. Great. All right. Fantastic. So what is about our timeline then guys? Uh, I think we should start sooner rather than later. Hmm. I agree. Now. <laughs> well, yeah, basically. Yeah. yeah. Well, but we can. What I wanted to suggest. Why we can start now? So, um, why we we have to wait? Uh, we don't have to wait. First. We so don't. We can start. We? No. Yeah. Now we know our format. I suppose yeah. we can just go ahead. I wanted to suggest yes. for, for starting um, the new painting that we take maybe three weeks just to start. And then after that, when you have to add from the moment you open it on screen, you have two weeks to send it out. Is that something that we can work with or do we feel uncomfortable with that? Can you repeat? Sorry. Can you repeat? I didn't understand what you mean. Well, starting these new paintings from, from today, let's say. We have three weeks to to come up with the first layer because it's a little bit more work for, okay. for some people you have to uh, prep the uh, panel it's a, it's a little bit a problem just for this period because in july i will go away a lot uh, okay uh, until the the mid august mm -hmm. so go and back so if i for example uh i have the i start tomorrow I'm not sure if in, in three weeks I can finish. Okay, that's so, fair. Or maybe I study, but I don't tell you. And when I, <laughs> I study, I will tell you, okay, I'm sorry, but I can finish in three weeks. I don't know because, um, yeah, um, yeah, I'm a little bit worried uh, for this period, just because next um, is something that I want to tell you also for next week because I'm going to Paris and then I'm going to Barcelona and then I'm going to Bali. So I have a very <laughs> wow. easy, easy summer. So. Nice. Paris, Barcelona and Bali. We're nice. not jealous. So Bali, <laughs> you'll meet a lot of Australians over in Bali. Mm. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Bad for you. You. <laughs> yeah. All righty. So, I'll, so, I'll, Rose, do you feel comfortable if we started, let's say, uh, from our start date from August fifteenth? For me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. If we all started. Ah, for me, yes. Because I'm back the fifteenth, and then okay, and in September my daughter uh, starts the school, so yeah. No, I... I'm good with that yeah. personally because I am also going away and um, I'm going to be really busy with a couple of art markets when I get back. So I would love it to start our three weeks from August 15th. That Perfect. Okay. Let, that's set then. August 15th, we are starting our 18 by 24 panels with the theme of layers of discovery. Can we talk about talk about the theme a little bit? Yeah. Pardon? Well, I was going to say, can we talk about the theme a little? But it seems, Rose, you had something else. You yeah, I'm just wondering if for our individual pieces, are we working with that theme for the same show, or are we just keeping it open for our own pieces? For our own pieces, we keep it open. Okay. I see that then. Okay. Um, so. If uh, we start the 15th of August, it means that it has to be sent uh, within the 5th of September. That makes sense. That's three yes, weeks. Yes, that sounds like about right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So that, that gives us I a... Think, uh, this is better. Yeah, to have a date. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, and also I feel that if we open it on screen, we'll have set dates and we'll just have an element in the show at the start where we go past everybody and we'll just do a little round with like we did now. Like, what do you have? Have you finished it yet? Yeah. Yada, yada. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. Awesome. I think, uh, Ross, you said you wanted to talk about the theme a little bit. Maybe mm -hmm. we can uh, push that to next week. It might be an interesting okay. topic just to, to discuss a little bit more in depth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How do we feel about that? Sure. sure. Yeah. 
Then before we end, I wanted to tell everybody that Cheryl is going to be on uh, Kate Taylor's podcast at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time today. So uh, you could all have to tune in at uh, Kate Taylor Art on Instagram to hear what Cheryl has to tell us. Uh, Are you excited, Cheryl? Yeah, I think it's about eight o'clock. And I'm here at my mother's. I was at a funeral yesterday, Ross. Oh, about sorry. Book, so. sorry. With all the cousins. Mm. So that was, um, yeah, I, I mean, sorry, one of the cousins died. So I'm the youngest of a lot of cousins. So that was kind of funny. That sounds like the wrong thing to say, doesn't it? That was a lot of fun. <laughs> <but anyway. laughs> you can only see people at weddings and funerals. So. I know, it's true. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's true. Well, um, I'm excited to hear what you have to say tonight. Yes, me show. too. I know, but I, I mean, I'm, I'm up here at my mother's place, so I'm I'm feeling really, um, um, you know, that I, I, I don't have the comfort of my own home or mm. if you get my drift. Yeah. And my mother is deaf, and so she'll just walk in and <laughs> heaven knows what's going to happen. It'll make for an interesting her, interview. You know, the nice candles back here, you know, the, these, these sort of, anyway. <laughs> I think you're going to be perfect. Cheryl, do you have any of your paintings Funny. there? Yeah, I, I've actually got I've actually got a real lot of ones that I went through art school with. So I've, I've got, you know, this, yeah. But the problem is that my mum's got a really old home. It was 100 odd years old. So it has those very tiny little windows. It's as dark as anything. Yeah, it is so dark. So I was actually, and there's all this wrap everywhere so in front of the painting she's got vases plastic flowers <laughs> and i sort of and i'm trying to embrace it and i'm going but no <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, uh. oh the joy of not being in your own studio <laughs> <laughs> and it's like and it's and it's probably about zero up here even it's probably minus because tamworth is really really cold and we don't you know she doesn't have so like proper heating I'm going, oh, God, I'm going to have to go outside, you know, oh, you know, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Your internet's good, though. Yeah. Um, um, I'm just running it off my phone. So ah. I'm just hot because she doesn't have internet. And I did have a little sign come up sort of saying your internet's unstable, but I'm hot spotting it off my phone. I'm just using my phone. But well, anyway. you're fine. Yeah. <laughs> good luck. Have yes. a good time. Yeah. Everybody needs to tune in <laughs> at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Does anything have anything? Uh, words are hard. Does anybody have any last minute things to add before we end the show for today? Nope. Nope. It's super quiet. <laughs> <laughs> We're all working away. <laughs> okay, awesome. Well, uh, then. Um, if anybody has any questions for any of us uh, in particular, or for us as a group, make sure you post them in the comments so we can get to them in the near future. And then uh, next week, apparently we will be talking about our theme for our uh, upcoming paintings, which will be an interesting discussion, I think. Um, I, I hope we will have a different host because I think you all have heard enough of me speaking <laughs> in the last couple of weeks. No, and I'm lo losing my voice a little bit here. Um, so almost, yeah, I'll host next week, but we haven't. Well, we'll, we'll be hosted by the lovely Stephanie next week, so join us then. And uh, until that time, I wish Rose a, a safe flight to Montreal. Yes. And um, mm. Lara, you're not leaving yet on vacation, no, in the third of July. Okay, so you'll have a little bit left still. Good, I good. Will be here. Okay, awesome. Well, good luck with your interview, Cheryl, and uh, we'll see you guys yes. uh, next week. <laughs> Bye. 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 Next week. Take care.